If you're not getting noticed, it's because you're not fucking good enough. And if you're not good enough, it is your responsibility to get good enough to where you stand out amongst your peers. This is your responsibility. If you are in a place where you truly feel like you are doing excellent work every single fucking time without fail and you are not being recognized, that means you're in the wrong place. Conditions will never be perfect, ever, okay? And a lot of people, me included for a long time, sat around and waited for the stars to align or the sea to part or for everything to be perfect for me to just go. And if it wasn't perfect, I'd come up with a justification. Whatever these things are that you're trying to do, there are going to be wave after wave after wave after wave of inconvenient shit that hits you in the motherfucking face, all right? That doesn't matter. People who win, win regardless of those waves. It's not that they don't have those waves, it's that they say, hey, I can't control what the fuck is going on. All I control is what I decide in my mind and the actions I take. Some days are gonna be harder than others. Some days are gonna be a little easier than others. But I can promise you one fucking thing for sure. There will never, ever, ever be a day that goes exactly as you want it to go. It doesn't exist. So with that being said, if you're going to wait around for perfect circumstances, how can you ever accomplish anything? The majority of people think they're doing a much better job than what they actually are. They, are. they think they are much more consistent than they actually are. And the goal is not for you to claim how hard you work and how good of a job you do. The goal is for every motherfucker around you to notice. That's called becoming undeniable. Becoming undeniable in your work ethic, undeniable in your fucking skill set, and undeniable in the results you produce. If you can get to that point and get past the whiny, weak, average standard of, I'm doing all I can which we all know is bullshit, you will become a winner. There's a, a lot of people out there that are constantly trying to improve themselves by looking for the one change. The one change, right? The one change in their life that's gonna make their dreams come true. 
and even worse, on top of that, there's a lot of people out there, a lot of self-help gurus and these hyperactive motivational speakers and these other self-appointed modern Zen yoga warriors that they're trying to sell the one thing. They're trying to sell the nine steps or the enlightened path that's going to allow you to unlock all of your human potential and fulfill the dreams so you can live the life that you've you've always wanted to live. Now, I'm no guru. And I definitely don't claim to be. I'm just a man. But I will tell you this. It isn't one thing. And it isn't ten things. And it isn't a hundred things. It isn't a quick path. And there are no shortcuts. Meditation won't get you there. And neither will a miracle drug or an organic supplement or some superfood. Getting better isn't a hack or a trick or a one change that you need to make. Getting better is a campaign. It's a campaign. It's a daily, a weekly, it's an hourly fight. An incessant fight that doesn't stop against weakness and against temptation and against laziness. It's a campaign of discipline campaign of hard work and dedication. It's waking up early and going to bed late and grinding out every second in between. Every single day. So, you want to get better? You want to self-improve? Stop looking for a shortcut and go find your alarm clock. and your passion and your drive and find your will. And then, and then you will find your freedom.